Hello everyone, Rock hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play New Super Mario Bros. DS. Today we did the last one, we finished World 3 and we're gonna start and we're gonna go to World 4. And okay, but basically what you need to get to World 4 is to use your um okay, so use mini Mario so you can get through there. So you, have to, you have to beat the front you have to beat the boss for this world with mini Mario. And then you can go to world four. So right now I'm gonna cut to the, um okay right now I'm gonna cut to the boss because I'm not gonna show the, the whole level again. So right now I'm gonna use my magic because so, right now I'm use my magic cutting power and cut to the boss. So magic cutting power that was pretty quick. I didn't have a chance to even finish saying that. Anyway, yeah, this is the this is the cast this is the boss. So basically, what I like to do is just jump at him twice as normal Mario. Then after that, use mini Mario and kill him. So right now, the, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do right now. Just jump at him twice with normal Mario and use mini Mario to kill him. Right after. Like right now, yes, he's smaller. He's and right now. I'm gonna get hit by him. Use mini Mario. And yes, you're pretty much all good. Just jump on him. And he's dead. Yep. Boing, you're dead. After that, you just have to the key and do a lot of path again. You love path to the next world again. Hooray. Huh? All is well. All is all good. Anyway, we're not going to world four. We're going to we're going we're not going to world three. We're going to world four and, and okay, for some reason that that sign changes the way you go. So um so here we are, World Four, the forest based kind of place in in this game. Yep. I want to say about that the background of this place looks nice. I like how the background looks looks so peaceful. Looks like I never actually saw this in the Mushroom Kingdom in any other Mario games. It, the only the only time I actually remember seeing this is in Mario World, kind of. It can be even though this place looks nothing like how did I not die over there? What the heck? Oh yeah, so um, another, so another thing I forgot to tell you, that water actually kills you. Yes, kid, a, kid, a purple water actually kills you, so don't touch it. Oh no, this is polluted water or something. Like water with poop in it, and Mar if Mario touches it, he's dead because well, basically he got a disease, so he can't live. So I guess if he touches that poop with water, he's gone. He's dead. So yeah, that's good. That's bad. Mario had to save the princess again. I don't know why, but Mario just thought he was okay to just leave the princess over there and just go check what had you know what's happening to the castle, you know, in the beginning of the game. And yeah, I died right there. And the way in the beginning of the game, Mario just decides to go check, really make sure he brought Peach with him because really she was gonna because really he was gonna to really like like really I don't know why, but he he just thought it was okay to leave Peach over there. Like, do you know how many times? Do you know? Do you know how many times she got kidnapped? Yet you let. Okay, yet you do it again and let her just. Oh my gosh! Forget about that. Why do I? Why am I dying a lot? Why am I dying a lot? You know I do die a lot in this part, just so you know. I don't know why I die a lot in this part. Though it's not on this particular level. I die on the next level. Uh, yeah, another death. Yay. Here I go. I don't care about Mario's life that is, uh, you know, at this time, I guess. Because I pretty much just start killing him. So yeah, uh, I'm pretty tired right now. Uh, high school to go to, the face through school and stuff. Tomorrow, tax is coming. You know, no, not tax, you know, the star test is coming up. And that test, I only have four hours to complete that test. So basically, if I don't finish the, the test in four hours, I'm pretty much done for it. And I failed the test, so yeah. But don't worry, but no, but the test is not tomorrow for me. Okay, the test is the week after this week, so yeah. Well, what am I talking about school for? I guess I really don't have anything else to talk about. Oh, and oh, yeah, I do have something to talk about. I forgot to tell you. Um, I forgot to tell you like a kids are. Okay, so in this part, okay, okay, in this part, we're actually first introduced to these weird spider guys with 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 whatever those are. I don't know what the heck that is. Those things on their legs, they're like plunger, plunger leg thingies. I don't know what the heck they are. And we're first introduced to those guys, and well, yeah, they're pretty easy to kill. Just jump on, pretty much just jump on them, and they hang from their spider webs. Oh, yeah, 
you need to unlock the path to this to the mushroom house. Well, because I'm gonna go. I'm kicking out because I'm also gonna go to world seven after I'm done with world six. Because world seven is also a hidden world, so yeah, I'm gonna go there later after I finish world six. This game is pretty quick. Wow, pretty much we're almost done with the game. Kind of like halfway there. But not really, cause I didn't I, I didn't even finish this I didn't even finish this this place. So anyway, kidding. We're now in the next world and we're, we're in the next level. And we're actually first. Well, we're not first introduced, but yeah, yeah. We actually are first introduced to these. Um, we actually first introduced to these weird these weird purple mushrooms that you know, okay that slant depending on which side you're on. See, like right there, they slant depending on which side you're on. Watch out for those. And this level where I fell a lot, so get ready for a fail, because right now I die. Goodbye. Yes, I die here because well I guess I wanna jump on that uh, on that Koopa and I just failed to jump on the Koopa. So yeah. Don't fail to jump on the Koopa and you're pretty much fine. <sighs> <sighs> yeah. Probably should have made a fail video for this because I do fail a lot. And I forgot to jump. So anyway, I think I do f like lose, like fail, like six. How many times? How many times? That was one. That was two times right there. So I'm gonna fail again. I don't know how many times I do though. So let's see. Okay, the star coins obtained. We lose my my mushroom power, and we're pretty much. And yes, I die again. That's number. Th I don't know why I did that. I don't, I don't know why I just jumped into the pit for. Anyway, that's number three. That's fail number three. What's the next one? How do I die this time? I don't remember. Hmm. Oh, the Koopa's dead. Yay. Anyway, oh, that's why that. That's number four. That's number four. Alright, I think there's two more. That's my guess. You guys can guess too, because I do fall around in this game. In this part. Oh, that's number five. Never mind, that's not two more. Now I have two more. Yeah, now I have two more fails, I think. I'm guessing. Anyway, that's how I died but there before because it's... Okay, basically I didn't jump high enough and I just want to jump. So I didn't... Yeah, so I pretty much didn't have any jump... Yeah, I, I didn't... I just didn't jump high enough and I just fell down the pit. I don't know how I'm in the clouds now for some reason. I, I'm just found, somehow find myself in the clouds. Even though I'm in a forest level. Anyway, oh, okay, that's death number three. I mean, no, no, number six. I'm, I think that's death number six. How do I die this time? I don't know. I don't care. Huh. Anyway, yeah. Get that star coin, Mario. Oh yeah, that's death number seven because of that stupid Koopa. See, look, in case I'm not looking on my lives, I used to have like twenty. Now I have 12. Because this level's mean. It's freaking mean. What the freak? I don't like this level. Man. I don't like this level. I really don't like this level. Oh, another death. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just knew I was gonna die there. Okay, that's number 8. Almost 10 deaths in one part. Almost 10 deaths, um, deaths in one part. Wow. I don't know. I don't know. I just really don't know why I'm losing. Anyway, yes, yes. At oh wait, no, actually. Okay, think there's one more death because yeah, I picked. Oh no, never mind. I think we're finished. Yeah. You know what? I think we're finished with the deaths now. Okay. That was close. Almost ten deaths in one part. That was. That was a close one. Anyway, that was a stupid idea. I don't know why I did it. I don't know why I did that. Oh, oh, but that probably leads it to a star coin, so so, so, you, so you can pretty much just probably watch someone else's OP. How to get the star coins? Cause I'm not gonna get them in this part. So yeah. Finally finished with this level. I'm glad we're I'm glad we're over with it. Anyway, we're going to the next level. This is the water. This is the water level. Hmm. I feel kind of I feel a little woozy today right now. Wow. Anyway, we're in the water. Oh, wait, not yet. Now we're in the water level. Hello everyone, welcome to the water level and the water level and the forest levels and the forest world. So, yeah, that makes complete sense. Get that, you get that fire flower and 
Because I need, because I needed that fire. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! A giant eel! It's gonna eat me! It's going to eat me! Oh my gosh! Yes, we're first introduced to those giant eels that try to kill you. You can't kill them, I think. I don't know if it's possible, but right now you can't kill them. So watch out for those. Watch out for those, and they just keep on coming. And these are the small ones. These are the smaller. Yo, guys, we try to kill you. So watch out for those too. Yup. Yeah. That was. That was. That was cool. Yeah. Yet still watch out for him. Still watch out for the giant eels. These eels. Oh no. When? Oh. Okay. Though we don't know which game they're first introduced in. Okay. Though I'm guessing this is in this game. I just never played much more. Okay, we did play a lot of Mario games, I just didn't play mu um, mu much of the good ones. Okay, no, the Mario World, I didn't play much of Mario World. Yeah, then I didn't play much of Mario Bros. 3 yet. I'm still in World 2, so. Yeah, the sandy area. Okay, though, I did play Super Mario. Th um, okay, though, I did play Super Mario Land. Um, um, I can uh, Yeah. Okay, I play Super Mario. Okay, I play Super Mario Land. It's Super Mario Land 2. And Super Mario Land 1 sucked. And Super Mario Bro Okay, Super Mario Land 2, and 2 rocked. I didn't like Super Mario Land 1. Because. Well, it didn't, f it didn't even feel like a Mario game. It just looked really weird. It just looked really. Really weird. If you ask me. I didn't like Super Mario World 1. Anyway, do we get the one up in this place without that Goomba? Because basically, you can just jump and make it. Like right there. And I didn't get that last star coin because I didn't know where to go. I didn't know I was supposed to go inside a pipe. Anyway, we're bringing peace to this place, so let's open the next. Let's open the next path. Anyway, we're in the castle. Yeah. Tower. More of a tower, because you actually go up most of the time in these. I mean, I mean you usually go up most of the time in these levels. So, I'm gonna call them towers, instead of, instead of, you know, instead of castles, because, well, I don't know, is the tower a castle? Kind of, as sometimes. So, yeah, this is the, this is the tower, and in this place, the lava's chasing you, so watch out for the lava, it tries to kill you. And we also first introduced these weird, um, to these climbing things, and those weird fuzzy, Destroyer, um, those electric guys. Never like those guys. Never will. I don't care about them. They're they kind, of, they're kind of strong. They, you know, they get that. Okay, they electrocute you. I, um, like which game were they first introduced in? I have no idea. Cause I, I haven't really played much Mario games. I, I play a lot of Mario games. You know, I, I just don't play most of those Super Mario games. You know, like, I keep like um, like. Okay, like Super Mario Bros. 3. I didn't play that game. Super Mario World. Whoa. Okay, 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 actually, didn't finish Super Mario World. Yes, okay, just so I know, I didn't finish Super Mario World. Okay, so I actually did just see the ending. Cause if, oh my gosh, I died. Ugh. <sighs> okay, anyway, just see the ending. Cause I okay, just see the ending. Cause I watched my brother play the whole game. Yeah, so he finished the game, not me. Yeah. The final boss is pretty easy in that game. I'm not here to talk about that. Anyway, we got Shin Mario, because Shin Mario sucks, and I guess I'm gonna give him another chance. I'll give you another chance to redeem yourself, Shin Mario. Don't think you're. Just don't think you're cool, because you're not. You suck ass. Shin Mario's first introduced in this game. Well, I think so. I think it's first introduced in this game. Anyway, he sucks, so you, you pretty much don't know my opinion about him. So screw Shin Mario. And there's and there's Bowser Jr. with this bandana. It's, um, he has um, he's really with this um, ban um bandana. It's really harder to fight because he uses more of his shell shell form a lot. And I do kick him ass beat a little, but I just kill him because he just makes me angry. So he's dead. Anyway, yeah, we defeated him, and thank goodness. Why is he even here? He should be in Road Five. Get out of here. Why are you here? Go to World 5. Anyway, um, anyway, this is Gamer Pimp signing out. I'll see you all later, and I'm ending this part. Thank goodness. I don't feel so good right now. Anyway, I'll see you all later. Oh, and, yeah, goodbye.